All right, my friends, welcome back to PGA Tour 2K23 Career Mode. We are gonna be doing the Legends Championship today, which is basically the Masters Championship. It's a course designed to look like Augusta in 2K23, which is Lone Grove Golf Course. Um, even in the screenshot there, you can see it. Just It just does look like Augusta, and when you get onto the course, it even feels like it as well. But this is a 72-hole event. We're gonna do rounds one and two today. I am actually using the Elite Controller in this video, the uh, PS5 Edge Controller. I'm gonna try and get good with this controller, because I do feel like this could actually be uh, hugely to our benefit if we get good with this controller. I do believe that. I'm gonna put the dead zone adjustment at 5%. I haven't really like found the right level for that yet. Um, I tried precise movement on this and it wasn't really that good. Um, I could try some of the other ones, but I think I'm just gonna stick with the default one for now and put the dead zone adjustment at 5% and see if that works. And uh, yeah, we're gonna see if we can uh, if we can go low here at the Masters Championship or the Legends Championship. Let's do this thing. Please do drop a like if you're enjoying the career mode video. We very nearly have hit 500 likes already on that last part. So uh, sure, we'll start up a rivalry with Justin Rose as he just won at Pebble Beach last week. I played with him at Pebble Beach and then he ended up winning winning at Pebble Beach. So that'll tell you I am a little bit of a messiah, my friends. Anyway, if you're interested in watching Hogwarts Legacy at all, you can check out my second channel, The Apex Sound 2. We're absolutely banging out content over there. It's been a phenomenal series so far and uh, it's doing really well over there. We're approaching 10,000 subscribers on the second channel. If you want to get 10% off Rogue Energy, uh, you can do that. I'm using a different shaker cup. This is one that G my friend Genie sent me, but it's still Rogue Energy inside in the shaker. Um, I got strawberry kiwi today. Or no, sorry, I have pink lemonade mixed with fruit punch today strawberry kiwi i had yesterday what am I, what am i talking about but pink lemonade mixed with fruit punch is actually kind of goaded anyway let's jump in you can get 20 percent off using my code as i said and let's play let's play 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 yeah you can see immediately how how strikingly similar it is to augusta right big fast on that one that's okay that's all right it'll take us a little bit of getting used to as well i might actually try even play with this controller plugged in and see if that makes a difference because i haven't done that yet i just want to see uh try and see all of the benefits of of playing or with it with this edge controller i want to find a good uh, good balance i imagine this is just going to be an awkward distance here but we'll see a little bit fast on that one but not the end of the world if it does maybe catch this hill out here it could come back down towards this pin but i don't think it's quite gonna catch it a little unlucky but decent shot not the worst not the best and if this isn't working i'll probably just switch over to the purple controller after like nine holes or something but i want to try and get good with this controller first these greens are gonna be ridiculous now because this is as i said to emulate the masters greens are only 159 so it's not the end of the world but i have a feeling they're gonna be difficult anyway okay par on the first we'll take that legends championship is this the one we won before i can't remember is this the one major that we won i should check my trophies yes so i'm actually defending my championship here which i didn't even think about tempo's been pretty ass so far but I mean, what can you do? C'est la vie. C'est la vie, my friends. C'est la vie. 337, not a bad drive there. Let's see if we can put one close. Tough one, this one, because like I don't want to be down here or else we're coming off the green. So we need to be ultra careful of this one, but we also want to try and get it on there and get it close. I need it faster than that one, but that's a good swing. Really good swing. A little long. I thought that as well. I thought that might be a little long, but I didn't want to risk being short. I did not want to risk being short. That's going to be a tough putt from there. For sure going to be a really difficult putt, but better than being down the bottom of the green, that's for sure. Right, that might be just short, I think. That might be right in the hole, actually. Oh! That's tough. I feel like that deserved to be in. I feel like that deserved to be in. But yeah, I would greatly appreciate you guys checking out the Apex Sound 2. I'll have 10 dates coming up there soon as well. Uh, 10 dates is going to be this super fun dating simulator game that I'm playing. Um, a, sim uh, a sequel to Five Dates, which I actually played right here on this channel uh, a few years ago, and people seem to really love it. Uh, but yeah, I'm done plugging the second channel now. I just thought you should check it out because I always see people saying, like, even commenting and tweeting at me, are you going to are you gonna play Hogwarts Legacy? I'm like, yeah, I've done five videos on the Apex Sound 2. People just don't even realize the Apex Sound 2 channel exists, even though I do mention it. Um, I feel like it just kind of gets brushed over in passing sometimes, I guess. But let's, uh, let's try to put this one close. I think I might even come back to the 152. As crazy as that might seem, I think this is going to be the right, right decision. Watch and learn. A little fast, a little bit overpowered, but it'd be a lot worse there. It's going to bump onto the green. Oh, it's actually going to... Ooh. All right. It's going to be short, but that's okay. I'm going to chip this in. Can you get a little Dr. Chapinski action? 
Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Oh, didn't quite turn in. Good effort. Three pars in a row to start the day, though. Um, it's not brilliant. It's not poor. It's just bang average so far. All right, let's try. I just want to try and change the sensitivity of this thing again. Just try and change dead zone adjustment to maybe like 15% and see if that does actually help or, or hinder it when that's up. Like, uh, let's see. That was a big slow. I felt that one, though. I didn't really, really even push that forward that much. But that's okay. It's a decent golf shot still. Gives us a chance Time to go at this in two. Here at the four. And I'm going to do just that. It looks like yeah, see, that was a good one. Really good. Here. That could be all over it. Holy shit. Just a little too far left. I think this is going to kick just off the green. But wonderful, wonderful golf shot, to be honest. And that gives us a good eagle chance here on the par well, that's five. The green there, Rich, in just a couple of shots. That's fantastic stuff. It's an aggressive play, Luke. Like to did see. I play it out. Did I play it out enough? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Boom, baby, eagle time. It's eagle time. Boom, shaka laka, baby. All five. We're gonna see Justin Rose in action. Yes, we are. Second shot. Second shot. Is he gonna put it close? Too far right for my liking. Oh, he gets lucky. He gets lucky. Oh, what a roll from Justin Rose. Wow. We're actually not playing with Justin Rose, which is interesting. I was wondering why he was on hole five and I'm still on hole four. So we're not playing with Justin Rose in this video. Usually you always play with your rival in round one. But maybe we'll play with him in round two. I don't know. Yeah, see? like my, Now that I put it to 15%, tempo seems so much better. Tempo seems a lot better. Although I seem to be a lot closer to perfects. I'm still not hitting perfects, but I'm a lot closer to him. And that yeah, just that gets lucky that that even stays on the fairway, to be honest. He's in the hole out of us. Let's see if he's going to put another one close here. Justin Rose. Justin Rose. He's one over at the moment, I believe. I saw on the leaderboard. Let's see if he can get one back here. For an eagle. That's going to be pretty close. That should be a birdie for Justin Rose. But knowing these highlights, you just never know. You just never know whether it's going to actually make the birdie or, um, or not. All right, pitch shot should be absolutely perfect here. Like, I mean... Triplimely perfect. Just a little off, a little spin. Good tempo. Not a good tempo, but that actually could still work because I had a shocking swing plane on the way back. And that does work. It's an incredible approach. To follow up the eagle well, with a birdie a, would be quite nice, nice. And we do. We do, baby. Oh, Massive. Lone Grove Golf Course. Course. It's a great name for a course, actually. Yards, Rich, all the way back there at the tips. Yeah, no a little slow and a little push, so that's going to be a little right off the left. fairway. It, but it shouldn't be too bad from there. I think we still should be able to go at this in two and, just that and get it on the green there. Not ideal, but it'd be worse, as I said. I'm going to be careful this bloody lip of this bunker, though. Yeah, I probably could have gone another club or two up, but I didn't want to risk it just in case... We stayed in the bunker. I'd rather give myself a chip Getting shot than, than somehow end up staying in that bunker. Oof, that was a horrible one. Horrible swing. I felt that right away, though. Horrible, oh, horrible, hey. horrible golf What's swing there. In front of him here with this putt? Yeah, 15 feet out. He's been give, me give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Damn it, bogey. BBFU. I make my first birdie and I follow it up with my first bogey. On the seventh. All right, watch this. Ready? Y'all ready for this? Y'all ready for the hole in one? The hole in one? The hole in one? Not quite, but it's a really good shot. Quite simply lovely golf shot. It's a little bit unfortunate to go that far yeah, past the pin, but flush. that's uh, definitely makeable yeah, on the way back down. Go on, Don't think I played it high enough. Hole. Damn it. Ah, oh, so close. ah steadies the ship. For a Would have been nice here. to get a PBFU after the PBFU, but we'll take a we'll, we'll take a par to steady the ship. Not the end of the world. He's doing hey work guys, here. Third shot. Here this means it's, this is going in, I think. He, gets set for his next shot here he had to lay here. up with a second. And he oh, right spins the it in there. Justin Rose oh, with a beauty. All right, Billy Horschel leads the way at four under, so there's really not that many people going super low under par right now, but we'll take it. We'll, we'll allow it right now. We'll allow it right now, because uh, we're in the mix. We're in the mix, baby. Oh, well done. Playing from around 160 yards. All right, this Just should be absolutely perfect. Oh, yes, there we go. That's the shot I've been looking for. 
Where have right, you been all my life? Glorious here. golf shot. And a glorious result. Well done, well done, well done. That yeah, should get us to three under par now. And that nine. must have been on a par five. Seven feet to the cup. Hit it hard, but holds yeah, his line it's and it's that's gonna be a birdie. Takes and we got a par five nine. coming out to close out the front nine. It would be really yeah, nice if we could birdie that and shoot a four under front nine, get ourselves in contention in this tournament here. Billy Horschel's five under through nine. We'd need an eagle to tie Billy Bo Piper. Kinda looks like the 18th at Augusta, doesn't it? Very similar, actually. And there we go. Another perfect. Beautiful. Look at that swing plane as well. That's just disgusting. That swing plane's disgusting. Maybe this edge controller is coming around after all. I didn't think it was going to be good for people. Hey, this is a complete copy. What the fuck, bro? This is like, honestly, a complete copy of the 18th at Augusta. That's hilarious. They really have taken some liberties with this. <laughs> I'm telling you, like, it's kind of a little too similar in certain spots. Oh, now I've started to find my form with this controller, my friends. Oh, I right found my climb. form at the perfect time here at Augusta. And now this is going to come back down off this. Let me tell you, this is going to be close. Might not have gone up enough to come back with any real venom, but that's a that's a quite simply lovely golf shot. It's going to be an eagle putt here, and it might actually be an albatross. No, it's going to be a tap-in eagle. Not quite a tap-in, but... It's going to be a little uh, little knee knocker down the hill for Eagle, and that should be that. Bang. Boom shakalaka. Eagle. Five under through nine. Let's go. Oh, wow. This one should find the rough. That was really bad. <laughs> that was quite simply atrocious, mate. Uh, the, the bad thing is I could actually reach this, but there's no way I can actually get it there, you know? What if I do this? Is this going to be one of the craziest things I've ever done? Possibly, potentially, yes, but am I going to do it anyway? Oh, I hit it way slow. Get through, get through at least. Get through at least. Get through at least. Get through at least. Get through, at least. Get through this last three. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. That's fine. If I didn't hit that slow, I would love to see what would happen there. It can often be unpredictable how it comes out of the pine straw. Beautiful shot. And just overpowered it perfectly as well. That could be close. Oh, took a big, big hop forward, but that's okay. The chance for the par uh, after the eagle there. Justin Rose. Is he going to hold it? Oh, JR. You filthy young man, Justin. Bang. Right in the middle. Right in the middle. Come on. Let's have it, son. I'm actually hitting the 194. No one. No way I'm hitting the, uh, the one lower than that. Watch this. Ah. Looks to be going with the five iron. Damn it. Just pulled it a little bit and hit it fast. If I had done one or the other, I think this would have still got I would have got away with this. Go on, get get down, get down! Oh Time for the second shot If it had got down, this would have been a tap in, bro. Oh, that's horrible. Not getting there. Good effort though. Good effort. I thought it would be hard to stop it short, well but we done. did. It's going to be a tap-in part. Man, that would have been an easy bird, bird if that had just just came off that fringe there. But it doesn't, and Billy Horschel leads by two. I was about to say at Augusta, but at Lone Grove. Oh, last two feckin' tee shots have been horrendous, and I felt them both times as well. I can't even blame the controller on them. I, I really just did not hit a good shot, and this is going to be a problem now, because I can't really go at this, can I? Love the beauty of it, but I think I might just lay up here. You know what? Fuck it. YOLO. YOLO. And going with driver off the deck with this shot. Yeah, I might as well just get it on there. Give myself a long putt. <laughs> what a shot that is, by the way. Absolutely banged it up there. This is gonna be a really tough putt, but I think I'd rather that than a flop shot from across the lake, to be honest. Really this player stepped up their game, a bold play, hopefully a bold reward. That's too hard. It's way too hard, son. Damn it. It's gone, off. It's gone off the green, man. It's going to stay on the green, actually. No, it's not. <laughs> That's not your best it was making its mind up. Again, too hard, I think, but this one's in the middle, though, is it? Oh, it just doesn't turn back enough. I did pull it a little bit, to be fair, though. I think... If that had been a straight swing plane, that would have been in the hole. We'll have to accept the power there, unfortunately, and maybe in the end going for it wasn't the right decision, but I feel like I just hit a bad putt. I did just hit a bad putt, to be fair. First putt was... I held on for it, onto it for too long. A little bit slow, should be fine. I think this will... Yeah, this will be left of the bunker. And that's a good shot. Good shot, baby! Round one is going 
pretty good so far, I'll say. Not amazing, it's not bad. Not out of this world, but it's not bad either, as I said. Just nearby. And tiny bit slow, but that should work. Especially with the way that this screen is shaping towards the pin here. Good shot. Good shot. Not a gimme, but I mean... Shouldn't be missing this. Bang, let's go. Good birdie. Four holes left, five holes left here. 14, there's a par five. Then we have a par three and two par fives. Okay, let's go, baby. One shot back, boys. We could be defending our championship here. Remember, this is four rounds as well, so... Uh, this is going to be one for the long haul. That looks like a mushroom or a penis there, that bunker, but uh, a mushroom penis. That's over 300 yards, and this is reachable. For the driver. With Max Ben and Loft. I hit it unbelievably well. <laughs> oh, I knew that was fast the minute I hit it. I tried, because the last one I, I felt like hit fat. Felt like it hit fast, but... It ended up being slow, so I was like, I'm going to hit this one a little faster. But to be honest, I don't think I would have got it on there with my best shot anyway. So, I'll take that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Be the one. Go in. Oh, dunk it. Oh, what a shot. What a shot, boys. It actually runs out a decent amount there, which is unfortunate, but... Should be able to make this for a birdie. A touch of a feather. Right into the middle. Big birdie there. And we're on the match. That should tie Billy Horschel here. Is it going to tie Billy Horschel or is he going to make a birdie when we make a birdie? Let's see. Justin Rose is going to be looking to make a birdie here on the 15th. Is he going to be able to drain this one? Let's see. Justin Rose. Oh, no, it doesn't draw. We're tied for the lead with Billy Ho. Four holes remaining. Oh, my God. What the hell happened there? It's weird, because this controller, like, generally it feels like the tempo is much better, but then there'll just be one random one where it feels like I've just hit an absolute ass cheek shot, and it wouldn't have, feel, it wouldn't have felt that bad either. It's a strange feeling. That actually could get there. I'm not even trolling you. That could work. Oh my god, do it. Don't go too far left. Don't go too far left here. Oh, it's a good effort. Man, that just needed a tiny bit more pace through that section there. We would have been close, honestly. Missing the green was always an option. I didn't even push the stick forward there. Time now for the fourth. I genuinely just didn't even push the stick forward. What a moron! Trying to slow it down way too much. I don't know why I was trying to slow it down that much, and that's going to be an absolutely ridiculous bogey. Just after you tied for the lead, you gift it right back on the next hole. And uh, that is a horrible God, PBFU there. That was just a chip where I completely hey duffed guys, it. Completely duffed the chip there. Justin That's an embarrassment. He gets set for his next shot here on the That's 16. an absolute embarrassment. Justin Rose, another pot we're seeing from Justin Rose. This is another missed pot we're seeing from Justin Rose. It is another missed pot we're seeing from Justin Rose. I've seen so many so missed putts from this man. All right, 140. I'm going to hit the 150 for sure. 152. We can use that backstop if we need to. I just need a perfect tempo on this one. Please give me a perfect tempo here. No, I didn't get a perfect tempo, but that shouldn't be too bad. Give me a little kick to the left. Give me a little kick to the left. All right. That's okay. A little disappointing. It was so slow, but eh. it's so strange seeing my rival play on the hole ahead of me the whole time. Definitely isn't supposed to be like that, I don't think. Just a little glitch. Justin Rose out of the bunker. Has he done it? Oh, They're not going to show us. There we go. The second. That's in. Gotta be. Oh, yeah, just straightens out last second. Die. Ooh, I thought I had it. All right. Boring old car, my pick friends. Pick it, make it. We'll take it. All right, 17th hole. Hoping they play this one aggressively. Get it up there. A little slow. That's fine. That's just fine. 104%. Give us a flop from there, probably. Not a chip, honestly. Oh, it's 40 yards, so definitely a flop. But I can actually get this 45, 46 yard one close. Watch this. Gorgeous flop. Gorgeous flop. Well done. Beautiful stuff there. And that should lead to a birdie to get us back to 700. Hopefully back into a tie for the lead now. 
Well done. Two threes in a row. Let's make it three threes in a row to finish off the round and get to eight under and hopefully uh, be solo leader. No, John Ram has shot nine under par. Okay, John. John's fought his way into this. Billy Horschel shoots eight under, so it'd be real nice to get a birdie here on 18 and get ourselves in. So this is very similar to the other hole at Augusta. They have some holes in different positions that are just really similar to other holes at Augusta. I wonder if they even have the two-tiered green here. If they do, like, this has gotten getting honestly on the, uh, on the copyright side of things. It's not. It doesn't have the two-tier green, but I mean, yeah. To go into this elevated green I don't know if they'd get away with that, honestly. And make it as easy as right, let's see if we can get this close. And it's much easier said than done, Luke, as you and I both well know. A little fast, but I pushed it, so that might work. Now, the only thing is, is this going to carry back down the hill? We need it to. No, it's going to stay up. Damn it, bastard. Should it just come back down there? That's in. Doctor. Call it. Call it. Justin Rose waits. Shake my hand. Nicely done. And that's a chip in birdie to finish. Eight under par. We're cooking out here, boys. We're cooking. All right, round two. Here we go. I can't believe how far Tiger Woods is ahead in the FedEx Cup standings already. Man, they're gonna make a new bloody uh, a new rule where Tiger Woods is gonna start to twenty under at least. Like, <laughs> like he's too far ahead. You know. Let's go. Season long race for the FedEx Cup. Bang. Good shot there. Pleased you could join us for this second That's round a good action. one, mate. We'll take it. We'll take I'm it, baby. You know how we be. I kind of almost want to try the other way. analog, but I don't know if it's, uh, well, they're if it's worth it. Second place, so that's a there's plenty Watch of golf to be played, and they need to keep pressing to make sure they keep up with the leader. If Nuno nothing else, the minute don't I worry left about my what's going on thumb behind. go, unfortunately. Up to Rich. Let's see how this one Not plays good. Out. I'm going to be a great up and down from this spot. Told you. Told you. Oh, just need to be a tiny bit higher. But a power on the first. A little bit disappointing, considering the key shot that I hit, but... John Ram eagled the first hole. Jesus Lord. What a beast. <laughs> John Ram is an animal. All right, first three holes are pretty difficult, though, so... I mean, honestly, I'll take uh, I'll take what I can get. This is very similar to the par five as well, the par five second, um, except it's a bit of a shorter par four. All right, um, let's see. Down the hill, a little less club is required. Shit. Not sure if they there. got that one flush. This might not find the I fairway. didn't get that one flush, son. Not and my best one. here we are one. with the third shot. Get close. That was a beauty. That was an absolute beauty. Go in. What a chip. Fair play, that was a tremendous chip to get up and down for a par. Two good pars in a row here on the first two holes. We've had to grind them out. The first two are tough, as I said. First three, rather. This third one ain't too easy either. But we'll take it. He's playing with us this time. Let's go. And here he is for a birdie. Justin Rose to chip it in. Misses. Beauty. Absolute beauty. Just be a beauty. Let's see if it was the I don't right think call. I needed a bit more club, to be honest. Oh, they went with a bit more club, is what you said, rather. Now come back down off this hill. Yes. Come on. Keep coming. Keep coming, baby. Keep coming. All right. Good shot. Good result. Yeah, that, Great there. wind management, apparently. Should be a birdie. Part, ten feet from the and it is. Boom. What a great All right. Big birdie there. Tough par three. Birdie. So, as I said, first three holes are tough. We went through them in one under. We'll take that. I think we went through them in level par in round one, and then we eagled this fourth hole. Or no, was it the fifth hole that we eagled? Whichever was the par five. Justin Rose on the par three. This was just a few moments earlier. Justin Rose. Good shot. Yeah, this was the one I eagled for sure. All right, a little slow, but that should work perfectly. Now can we get this close and make an eagle? Like we did in round one. It would be really nice to make back-to-back -back eagles on this hole throughout the week, but it's playing a little tougher today because of the wind. And I don't know that I can actually even get it there with the three wood, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try to overpower this. Just pushed it a little bit, but I did hit it 105%. If this gets the best kick of my life, this could be really good. Oh, not far away this from getting down onto the green, but it's uh, a good chipping chance for an eagle. I'm going to just aim a little bit further right there and just try and chip this bad boy in. A little fast, a little too fast. Wow, that almost went in the that hole. That should be a birdie, but it's not a gimme. Well, it's nice to have a birdie putt. 
Looks good off the blade. I said it's not a gimme, it wasn't, but I make it just about. Back to back birdies there. And we get to 10 under, we get to double digits under par. And John Ram birdies the fourth there as well. So we're two shots back still. But, uh, wow, that was close. Sorry, I'm going to hit three wood here. That's so bad, it's okay. Jesus, thank God. If I hit that with the driver, that's in the water, unfortunately, so. Or fortunately, I should say. Let's catch up with it. Let's see. John Ram. Good shot, but it's not in. So John will be walking off with a power on this old. Control the distance here. It's slow, but that's perfect. That's gonna kick towards the pin. Oh my god, what a bounce that is though. Luckily gets a good bit of check there. And this is looking like it's a pretty dead straight putt, honestly. And it is. Bang. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, Boom. Good momentum, we get within one of John Ram with three birdies on the trot. Let's go, baby. Billy Horschel's matching me, though. Billy O is matching me. A little fast, but that should be fine. That should be good. I'm starting to feel a lot more comfortable with this edge controller now, guys. People are in trouble. People are in big trouble, let me tell you. Let me tell you something, son. What are we looking at here, Henny? Setting up here from about 185 yards. Because even the bad ones, they're like slightly slow or slightly fast now. There is some really bad ones still that I need to get out of my game with this controller, but generally that's a big improvement and that's a magnificent shot. Absolutely magnificent shot, my friends, and that yeah, is a birdie. Nice. Boom, four in a row. We're cooking now. Right, 240, 224 with a little spin, I think, could work here. Oh, this is going to be glorious. Watch. No, this is actually going to be the be best shot you've ever seen in your life. Ah, just hit a little fast. He's had a disagreement with the caddy. See, I think that would have been so good if I didn't hit that fast. This might actually come back down around and be pretty damn good, though. I'm going to come back down around this hill. Keep going. Don't you stop there. Don't you stop there, boy. Oh, my God, what a shot. Oh, it actually worked out magnificently. Either way, oh, we caught that hill strong, beautifully. I wasn't really actually playing for it to be quite that far out, but that's a beautiful birdie. Five in a row. Like Five birdies in a row here at the Masters Championship. And we are on fire, baby. Come on. 13 under, tied with Billy Horschel. John Ram's gone backwards. Billy Horschel and me are matching each other stride for stride here, though. Birdie for birdie. Billy Ho and Turlock Ely going at it here. You have to admire this. You have to admire this. That was a little fast, but that's fine. I thought that was going to be one of the one of the horrible ones, but we're not hitting those anymore. We are not hitting those anymore, my friends. Let's absolutely get it, son. Let's absolutely get it, baby. Oh, I felt it right away as well. You clown. That's still, for such a bad shot, that's not a bad result, though. And that could still be a birdie, potentially, because that was a horrible swing. That's in. Watch. On it right now. No, oh, it's missing left. Damn it, it was dead straight. What was, oh, was dead straight? Because I played it out a little bit left because it looked like it was breaking more to the left, to be honest. But not yeah, to be no, Celebi from in Dreamland here because nine is definitely a hole that you can get at. Yes! Just needed a good drive, and that's exactly what we've got there. And that should kick down towards the fairway as well a little bit. Just about. Just about. Good shot. This is absolutely perfect, I'm telling you right now. This golf ball left to right. Watch this. Don't Looks watch that. Like that was a bad shot. Going for it. Damn it! Bad tempo there. Oh. I really would have preferred it stayed up there. It's not too bad, actually. Still a good eagle yeah, chance, honestly. All things out. considered, that's a good good eagle chance. And if not, it's going to be a six under front nine if we, if we just birdie it anyway. To see how good this player is you know what? I'm going to make this. An eagle putt awaits. All right. All right, be careful, be careful. Settle down, Betsy, settle down, Betsy, settle down, Betsy, settle down, Betsy. Settle down, Betsy. Oh, ho, ho. if I didn't pull that, that's in. You can see on my swing plane, I just pulled it a little bit, but if I didn't, that's in the hole. And that's a good birdie there, and we tie Billy Horschel again. Good shot. We hit a shocker here in round one. This is going to be uh, just okay. I thought that was going to still somehow manage to find its way into the heavy rough, but it doesn't. We got a great power here in the first round. Let's see if we can get a birdie this time. Wind's blowing right to left here, and they're going to go ahead and ride the one in about here. that one, for fuck's sake. The good thing about this is, like, when I'm hitting a bad tempo, I can really fire, feel it so. there. Wind got that one and took it wayward. Good shot. All right. 
Top in birdie, or top in par rather, instead of an all around the world par like last time. It is 16 over. <laughs> the fuck? How is that the projected cut, bro? What the hell? Ah, looks to be fast. going with the four iron. Hit that, hit that, and come back down. Now. All right, it's not too bad. Pretty bad. All right, stop, stop. Let's make it. Good stuff. Let's make it. 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 Boom, boom, baby! Right into the heart of the hole. We are on a different level now, baby. That's to get to 15 under par. Three-way tie. How's John Ram got back to fucking 15 under as well? Three-way tie for 15 under par. What in the world's happening right now? What in the world is happening? I overpowered that to 104 and hit a really good tempo. That could potentially have the chance to go at this in two, but we're going to need a banging second shot here, and this is going to be risky. No, it's not that risky, actually, because I'm going for this straight up. I love this golf course. I love the beauty of it, but I got to say, it is a really difficult course. Golf shot. It's a golf shot. Get up that hill and we're golden. Get up that hill and we're golden. Oh, yes! That could be to get to 17 under here. We're putting on a show here. We're putting on a show, baby. Justin Rose nails it from the bunker. Fair play, my man. Let's see if we can, if we can make the eagle here. This is not going to be easy, but let's see. Get in, get in, get in. Nope. No, you son of a bitch. It's just about three feet away. Oh, for back to back it was an inch too much break He's there. Billy Orschel ties me again. Like I'm not That's ever going to get away from Billy Orschel, I feel like. Every single time I've made a birdie today, he's been there making birdies too. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. This hole is so nervy on the tee shot there because like you're worried about hitting it fast and going into that, into that little stream. And Henny? What are you I don't know what to do about bloody uh, Billy Orschel, honestly. Old hair and it's coming straight watch that shot. I'm telling you, watch the shot right now. <laughs> what a quality shot that was. I'm not like Alex. When I say watch this, I mean watch this. All right? Let's go. I'm not like Alex where I say watch this and hit it out of bounds or something. You know, that was absolutely glorious, my friends. What a shot. Justin Rose is trying to gain on us as well. But, oh, we hold it. Hold on, Justin. Is that an eagle? Bang. That, that should carry that bunker. It's going to be close. It's going to carry it. It's going to carry it. That's going. We're going to go at this in two now. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Come on, baby. They're thinking of going for this Light one, my fire right now. You're damn right I'm going for this. Oh, is it too much is the question. Yes is the answer, so I'm gonna hit this. I'm gonna put some loft on or some spin on it. We're gonna we're gonna go at this bad boy. Yeah, he's got his we're gonna go at this bad boy. Surface. We are gonna go at this bad here. boy with a beautiful three iron strike right into the heart of it. And that's gonna be close. That's gonna be another eagle chance. Is it gonna be our first oh, eagle of the day though? Up this hill can be firm here. Boom, baby, come on! What's going on? What's going on, huh? 19 under. 5 under for the last 4. And we are cooking at the Masters Championship right now. Lone Grove Legends Championship. 3 shot lead. 3 shot lead here, boys. We've come alive. We've come alive here to defend our championship. That's our worst shot of the day by far, but we should get away with that. It's better than our shot in round one. It's better than our shot in round one. We'll take it. We'll take it. Come on, boys. What a performance this is. What a performance. Come on. Disgustingly good. Oh, yes. I found, I found my tempo now. I've just found everything in this game now all of a sudden. That's in the hole. That actually might be in the hole. I'm not even trolling you. Wow, what a shot. <laughs> and wow, what, what is this golf, that boys? This might be round shot. of the year here. Just this might be round of the career here. John Ram is still chasing us like no tomorrow, though. He eagles 15. He's eagling that hole there. Like, what in the world? He holds out. I put it to two foot. Like, what is John Ram doing right now? John Ram needs to just chill. 
chosen the pitching wedge here. Audio cut out as I was mid swing. That was a little strange, but not the end of the world there. Could be a lot worse. We'll take it. And we'll try our best to, to make a birdie to try and get rid of John Ram here because he is not going down without a fight. But neither am I. I swear to God, this is the best run you'll ever see here on the back nine. What score am I right now? John Ram! What are you doing, man? This will not stop this man. Son Ram's on fire. This hole Watch is the shot. so important at this critical time. Go for it. No, Lay you clown. Back. The one thing How I couldn't do was hit it slow. You brain dead clown. Fast would have been fine. I was trying to need let the thread it to be close, man. But no, John, don't do this. Wonderful play there. Oh, thank God, John Ram's gonna make a par. What's this? This needs good hands. That was not good. I was not a watch this moment, but it actually worked out okay, and we still have a good birdie chance. Thank God I went for the uh, I went for the backstop because Jesus Christ, I would have been in the bunker still if I didn't. Bang, baby, good birdie. What a goddamn back nine this is. 18. If we can birdie 18, this is going to be. We're in fifth. We're out shooting in the 50s, right? I'm pretty sure no matter what, we're shooting in the 50s here. What did I shoot in round one? Eight under? Dude, am I 14 under right now? Am I 14 under? I love this whole Legitimately? If you're leading and have a chance to win, this is the team. That's shot kind of want. incredible There's if I'm 14 under right now. I don't think I'm 14. Right -hand side, tee it high if I only had like three pars? The best opportunity to go into this elevated green Holy with shit. a short iron to make yes, it I as have. easy as possible on you. And it's much easier said than done, Luke, as you and I both well know. A little fast, a little pulled. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay at best, but it's a chance. It's a sh it's a chance here. Shoot 58, by the way. Oh, so that's gonna be a 59. 59 at Lone Grove, my friends. We've won here once before. We know how to score here. It's a 58. Sorry. What am I talking about? Yeah, we're already 14 under 58. Wow, what a performance, guys. A 58. The new edge controller. Maybe it is going to be just grand after all. John Ram, 19 under Paris. Three shots back somehow. He's only three back. Justin Rose is T19 of two over. Jesus Christ, that's a big discrepancy from uh, from me down to the top 20. Good Lord, my friends. What a performance. We're 12 shots clear of fourth position. So it's between me and John Ram, basically. Maybe Billy Horschel's in with an outside chance of winning this thing uh, in the final two rounds. But what a bloody performance in round two especially round one we were kind of getting to grips with the edge controller and now i've come alive my friends i just shot 58 at the legends championship maybe we'll do well now in the all shot tournament with this controller as well we'll see what happens anyway thanks for watching guys really appreciate it. make sure to drop a big like it's the best way to let me know you enjoyed the content and i'll see you guys next time for another career mode video and i'll see you for much more content here on the apex sound channel thanks for watching see you next time peace out boys Break.